So the first thing you need to do is uh, log on to your business account and the ads manager and create a campaign. Uh, within the campaign, just there are a few things you leave as it is. For instance, catalog. If you're not running the catalog ads, then leave as it is and click on next. Um, choose the website um, considering you're um, trying to get the more conversions out of it so click on a uh, maximum number of con conversions and the purchase for this you need to have your pixel installed that's very very crucial um, leave the cost per um, result goal automatic for, for facebook to decide for the best results um, dynamic creatives uh, switch it on if you switch it on it will change um, the uh, you know the creatives accordingly but leave it uh off uh, for as a beginner choose the budget according to your needs or the budget you are willing to spend on um after that this is the audience uh how to select the audience and how to uh, put in the interest and all there are a lot of videos available on my channel which you can follow and then just simply leave the other things as it is and click on next so over here um choose the facebook and instagram page um keep the manual um uh, option on because uh, the catalog one is once you have uh, integrated the catalog or you ad want to advertise a certain set multi advertiser set means your ad will be shown with similar ads that are shown on other Facebook channels as well now we're going with the ahead with the single image choose the image um, for instance like this uh, let it upload and then click on next and from here you can crop uh, the size according to the um the placement where it, the ad will be shown so if you you know uh, keep on original it'll be very small just scroll it down click on crop and crop the image as per your needs um because this is how it will be shown uh, to the people so after that just click on next uh optimizations on let facebook optimize your creatives and ads accordingly and just click on done uh, so from here you can put the primary text on uh, whatever you're advertising for instance if it's a sale or there's something you'd like to advertise or tell to your customers um, just type it um, anything related to that and similarly um, put something on the headline and the description as well sorry about my keyboard it's acting weird for some odd reason right so this is something um the first image uh, the first text people will read and respond to your ad so this needs to be done um that attracts your consumers or customers for instance we're advertising sales so we're writing it down that you know happy hour sale is live and things like that similarly you can put uh, different things that can attract your customers in the ad right so after that um this is the description uh again for instance this up to 50 percent off this 100 percent off and learn more instead of learn more just put shop now and then the final link where you like your people um your consumers or customers to land at so they can have a look at the products that are being advertised um you can also add just to be sure yeah the same thing so opening so just to be sure uh right so you can also mention call whatsapp or whatever it is i i'm leaving it none so there's no confusion and people can simply shop onto my website uh languages is another option you can uh click on languages you can add language for instance you'd like to keep the basic english and um there's urdu spanish pushto whatever the language the second language you would like your uh, the people to see your ad in you can add that language as well i'm just keeping it in english um so because um the audience i'm targeting they easily understand and plus i haven't used any words that are very difficult it's very simple up to 50 percent off and you know the days that's about it so i'm just keeping it in english but like this you can add different languages as well right so after that uh you just need to see if your uh api is um integrated then it will be shown like this if just a pixel then that so to install the conversion api there's another video as well um uh, then just simply click on publish 
Now, so this is one single image which we have advertised, but within the same budget, we'd like people to see different options. So what we'll do is we'll click on the new ad set, we'll duplicate it, um, original campaign and just duplicate, simple. And after that, you can either go for the single image or the carousel or the collection ad. In this, we'll go for the collection ad. So because I want people to see collection, as well as the single images so the different sort of people who respond to different sort of ads so i can select 10 different images um, at once and i can just upload them um, and um, it'll be shown in my carousel like this Now I can select these, these are uploaded. Now I can select the 10 best images I think are the perfect for this uh, ad, like this. And I will just click on create after that. Yes. Now, instead of writing every single, uh, for the every single image, because my, it's it's for advertised for the sale and the description and the headline is the same. What I'll do is I'll write the headline I'll write the description, I'll put the link in the first image and then I'll click on the apply to all cards. Um, so it's automatically will be same, uh, will be pushed to all the, uh, cards I'm, uh, the uh, cards that I'm trying to advertise or to the advertisers as a whole. So as I said, my keyboard is acting a bit weird. Uh, I'm not sure why, but bear with me for a second and it'll be all done. That's happy hour sale. Right. So this is something up to 50% off or anything that you think people will respond to or you think is something worth mentioning for your consumers, for your customers. Do mention that because these, these are a few small details which people look at and they click on the ads. right so now as i said apply to all cards so it automatically goes to all of the cards you have updated link was already there so it's up to there just check if they yes it's correct now over here just put the primary text and the landing page similarly keep it to none and just click on publish and now within the same budget you and within the same act uh your two different ad sets you or two different creatives are running and facebook will automatically decide whichever is performing more the facebook is going to push that one to the um customers now at minimum i would use four to five ad sets ads uh within one ad set and this is how i as people mostly respond to the single images in my campaigns so what i'll do is i'll duplicate it so i'm pushing two single images and one carousel to my customers and i'm going to select another single image for this and this is one of my hot selling items so that's why i'm going to push this one uh the crocs and i am going to again see if it needs cropping or anything else it does so this is the complete part i'd like people to see i'll click on apply and then next and like this. yes and i'm going to save it and i'm going to publish it with the text and the description and everything as i have mentioned in the previously in my other ads or the creatives i have uploaded now this is how you within one ad set you create three different ads in my other video i'll share the link as well you can see how to create the multiple ad sets as well so you're targeting three different audiences in that but in this particular video you're just targeting one ad set one audience and three different creatives and this is what i usually do 
so if someone responds to the single images or someone responds to the casual or the collection ad so facebook will automatically keep on showing different ads uh, to different uh, people on the basis of their preference on their preferences um, however you know um, for instance i usually uh, respond to the collection ads or the video ads than the single images so that's how it's done uh, keep watching uh, more videos um, if you have any questions do not uh, you can always get in touch and you know uh, shoot me an email so i can help you with that